It is 1.57 a.m. on Monday, June 27, three days before Thursday the 30th when our trip begins. I currently cannot sleep, so I decided that I might as well record this pre-segment to the beginning of our awesome trip. Uh, on Thursday, we are going to be, of course, driving up to Washington, D.C. and flying down to Sao Paulo, where we will then be going to my mother's brother's house, I believe, for a day or two. So, good night, everybody. I will see you all in one second for you, in three days for me. Actually, not that long. Actually, yes, that long. Okay, so it is now January, not January. It's now June 29. Tomorrow, we fly out. But right now, um, I need to pack my bag. Living for tomorrow. Lost within a dream. Trying to find the answer to the question And it seems that love makes the world feel good Singing in the moonlight Dancing in the rain Let the sun shine through to lift your spirit once again Cause love makes the world feel good Chasing after rainbows Somewhere in the sky The home stretch to the airport right now, right there is the Dulles Expo Center. We got off Interstate 66 a few minutes ago, right, Dad? Well, we just passed Frying Pan Road, just passed Frying Pan Road. We're passing under the Washington Dulles Airport exit three-fourths of a mile sign. And we are starting to see the signs for the departure zones. This feels like forever. We are now going down to the security mezzanine, and there is, like, no one in the res uh, restaurant. What am I saying? No one in the airport, which is miraculous. Look at this. There's nobody. So we'll see you on the other side. Through security. That was almost the shortest time I have ever had through security in my life at an airport. There are very few people here. Would you agree, Mother? Yes. Now we are about to get on this train and get on our way to Gate C. So let's go. I'm gonna do what that guy's doing. Can it feel so good? Seagates. Smells like a sauna in here. Seriously, it smells like a dry sauna. Doesn't it? And so now, <laughs> in the tunnel to the sea gates. How are you feeling, Mom? Cold. And I'm feeling a little frustrated because I told you we don't have to leave home this early. We're gonna have to be waiting here for two hours you and fifteen minutes. You could have actually probably swam a couple of feet. I probably could have. We don't have to be here for another. Well, we start boarding at least a minimum. Of I'm out of my axe, minimum, minimum of two hours, so it's gonna be a while.
feel so terrible that I bought sunglasses. I didn't get any. us that basically on takeoff we got a notification about one of the valves which affects the pressurization of the cabin and that is why we had to it has had no effect on the actual engine but we it does affect the pressurization of the cabin so they are bringing a mechanic up to take a look at that to see if they can fix it in a timely manner as of right now we do not have an estimated time if it can be fixed, so just hang tight with us and we will keep you posted um, as soon as we find out more information. Currently, we are not letting anybody off the aircraft, so please just hang tight and stay comfortable and we will keep you posted. So we are now deplaning. Yep. They have an expected hour of maintenance before we can fix the problem. Right now what time it is is 6. It is 11.12. So the minimum, the, the, the yeah. earliest possible time we're going to be leaving is 12.45 or 1 o'clock. The earliest. And it's a 9 hour, 9, 9 and a bit hour flight. 9 and a half, 9.40. So far, a very adventurous trip, I'll say that. This is open. So I've got a sandwich. How about that? Yeah, that's pretty good. All right. On second thought, we're going to continue exploring. Look at the departures board. Let's look at this board, actually. Yeah. There's ours. São Paulo, 10:05. Return to gate. That's what it's saying, but it's going to be even later than that. So I got a turkey and provolone sandwich. He got a turkey and provolone sandwich. <laughs> you got food at the United Club. All right, it is currently, I think, 11.50 something. Hold on. 11.52 p.m. Still, of course, Thursday, June 30th. The reboarding has commenced. We are still chilling out here. Mom's gone to refill some water bottles. Oh, there she is. Well, then we'd better hurry back on if we want to get on this flight. We are boarding once again right now, hoping that we'll be able to arrive before 11 o'clock, which is possible. Back in the airplane for take two. 
right? Mm -hmm. It's 121. Um, we took off and 121 a.m. finally having dinner. It's really nice too. We are now out of the out of the border control and customs and stuff, and we are now going to try and find some place to sit where there's power outlets so that we can wait for our bus at two o'clock. Yeah, lucky us. Has come to an end. Now it's time to enjoy a vacation. Starting tomorrow. No, starting tonight. Okay. Is there any difference? We'll see us. Now, what is that? Mala?